I'm gonna show you today our new CKS Swiss QR add-on for Sub Business One. This add-on is based on a document management system and was amended to handle the new QR invoices for Swiss. It can also handle the old ESR standard. So our document management system has an inbox. This inbox, which you can see here, picks all the documents which you get from different systems, like mm, emails, which our CKSDMS server can pick up automatically, or a scanner, which can add automatically these invoices to the system. So in our case, we in a simple way now. So I select the file. I take the old format. And I take the new format directly as well. The system is adding now the documents to Sub Business One. The system are created automatically cat traces or the text recognition. Depending on that, we just say OK. The old ESR format here, I open the document. So you can see here that the payment receipt is added. So what I can tell the system now is handle this pay slip, payment slip. I say OK. The system is analyzing now this document, was finding out the reference number, the account number, and to um, the system wasn't able to find the correct supplier. So what I'm going to do is here, I select the supplier. The system is showing me document which are available. And when I say, OK, this is a base document. This is a line. I say generate. I have to enter a due date. What the system did, it generated automatically a draft invoice, which I can open, which is related to the purchase order with the selected line and the system automatically added the bank account to the business partner for the next recognition. It also filled up the pay to field. So if I add it now, this invoice is linked automatically to the AP invoice to the business partner. It disappeared from our workload from the inbox and we can search or we can go into the business partner now and can have a look which documents or AP invoices are behind the business partner. This is now pure DMS functionalities. So you can see it here. We can also search for these documents now. I enter this information here, say search. So the system is showing me now the related AP invoices. In our next case, we handle QR invoices. I take the QR invoice and I put them to the system. This is now a typical functionality of a scanner which scans the document and puts them to the archiving folder. The add-on was picking now the document and it appears now in the inbox. This document is here. So I'm gonna do, I use the functionality process payment slip now. And now the system found the supplier. I can select now the base document again, or I can say it's a service invoice. It shows me a service invoice here and I say select. I select the service invoice. I say again generate. I have to enter the due date. And the system is generating depending on the QR code. 
the AP invoice. That's it. Here is the amount. Here is the service account. Thanks for watching this tutorial. If you have any question, just contact us.